Hi friends, I would like to introduce myself. I am Kala Shaju. I would like to take 10th standard geography. The first chapter is season and time. We have to divide this chapter into two parts. Seasons and time calculation. Today, let us start with a small part of this chapter. When we draw lines like this, this is north, south, east and west. This is northeast, here southeast, southwest and northwest. Next, equator. When we draw a circle like this, we draw a line at the center. This is the imaginary line drawn horizontally at center of earth. This is the 0 degree latitude. It is the biggest latitude. It divides earth into two hemispheres, northern hemisphere and southern hemisphere. Next, latitudes. Latitudes are imaginary lines drawn parallel to equator. The 0 degree latitude, equator. Then here, 23 and a half degree latitude is known as Tropic of Cancer. 23 and a half degree south latitude known as Tropic of Capricorn. Here, 66 and a half degree latitude known as Arctic Circle. Here, 66 and a half degree south latitude Antarctic Circle. And here, North Pole 90 degree, South Pole 90 degree. Do you know India situates in which hemisphere? It is in Northern Hemisphere. Next, longitudes. Longitudes are the lines drawn from north to south, north pole and south pole. This is the zero degree longitude. The zero degree longitude is known as Greenwich Meridian. This is the biggest longitude. It divides earth into eastern hemisphere and western hemisphere. Opposite of this zero degree longitude is known as international date line. It is 180 degree. And the next topic is revolution. What is revolution? Earth revolves around the sun in an elliptical orbit. And this moment is known as revolution. Earth takes 365 1 by 4 days to complete one revolution. It causes seasonal changes. If this is a 3 mark question, these points are enough. What is revolution? Time taken. What is the effect? Now, Earth takes 365 1 by 4 days, that means 6 hours to complete one revolution. After 4 years, this extra 1 day is added to the 4th year. This day is added to the month of February. So, the year in which February have 29 days known as leap year. So, leap year means the year in which February have 29 days. Now let us study about the causes of the occurrence of seasons. And first one you studied revolution. Next one is tilt of axis. Tilt or indignation. And the third one apparent movement of sun. Now first tilt of axis. Earth is tilted at an angle of 66 and a half degree in the orbital plane. 23 and a half degree in the vertical plane. This is known as parallelism of earth axis. Once more, tilt of axis also known as inclination. The earth is tilted at an angle of 66 and a half degree in the orbital plane. 23 and a half degree in the vertical plane. This is known as parallelism of axis.